The financial year 2021-22 has been another challenging one for the NHS. A year where the NHS has risen to and continued to deliver against the ongoing challenges of the pandemic. Whilst making progress on reducing the number of patients waiting longer for treatment due to the pandemic. Within this context, the NHS financial regime responded to the changing external environment to provide additional support to meet the costs of COVID and the needs of its patients. To this end, once again, Liverpool University Hospital's NHS FT has performed well, working within the regime and with system partners and delivering a balanced operational position for the year. The reported deficit relates solely to a technical deficit due to an acceleration of depreciation on the old Royal Hospital following the welcome final confirmation of the Go Live timescale for the new hospital during 2022 and thus the exiting from the old hospital into the new. This technical adjustment was agreed and approved by NHSEI. This video highlights the key financial performance of the Trust in a year which, once again, shows the need for ongoing efficiency to ensure we deliver value for money for all our stakeholders and generate funds for investment back into frontline services and facilities. The need to continue to deliver improvements in productivity remains a key priority and focus for the Trust and the NHS in general, as we strive towards ongoing and underlying financial sustainability, whatever the financial regime of the day. Finance is a means to an end. Good financial performance enables our Trust to deliver on its goals and vision. It is for this reason that good financial management is a core pillar of the ethos that we strive for as LU HFT and a crucial ingredient in facilitating our trust-wide vision of delivering outstanding healthcare. The Trust was very honoured to receive a number of national awards for financial management during the year, including for financial governance, financial training and the overall Healthcare Financial Management Association HFMA National Finance Team of the Year. As with all the achievements in the Trust, it is the overall combined team effort of all colleagues that lead to success. This work does provide us with a sound base as the Trust heads into a more financially challenging period ahead. So, how did we do? During 2021-22, the Trust had an income of £1.15 billion, 86% of which relates to income from operating income from patient care activities. Expenditure from operating expenses in the year was £1.15 billion, generating a small operating surplus from continuing operations of £4.9 million. Staff costs represent the highest component of expenditure for the Trust at over 61% of operating expense and as one of the largest employers in the region, with over 13,000 employees, confirms the socio-economic importance and influence we have in the city, which we take very seriously. All staff played their part in the response to the crises and our mission to deliver outstanding health care to the population we serve, and they deserve all our thanks. Financial costs equated to £12.2 million, which left an overall deficit from continuing operations of £7.4 million, a position agreed and approved with NHSEI. The overall position includes accelerated depreciation in relation to the old hospital due to the welcome confirmation of the move date into the new Royal during the second half of 2022. Excluding the necessary depreciation, LUHFT achieved a balanced operational financial position in 2021-22. The expenditure in the year reflected continued response to COVID-19, with direct costs of £50.6 million incurred, including the ongoing vaccination programme. These costs are expected to fall during the coming year, as the impact of the pandemic lessens and the Trust returns to a more business-as-usual footing. During 2021-22, the Trust continued the construction of the new Royal and expended £128.1 million on its construction, 
which is recognized within the non-current assets of £993 million and accounts for the largest element of the increase in year. Investment has continued across all sites to ensure sites are optimized for patients and staff. Large-scale schemes at Aintree during 2021-22 saw £6.6 .6 million spent on completing the tower block recladding and £7.5 million on the redevelopment of the entrance and emergency department. The cash position of the trust improved during the year with a strong year-end balance of £211 million. A strong cash position is a fundamental building block of a financially sustainable trust. Recognizing the average daily spend in LUHFT is over £3 million. With the exception of a qualification regarding stock, which was not counted in the prior year due to COVID-19, we achieved an unqualified, clean audit opinion. Overall, the trust performed well within the financial regime established in 2021-22. However, as the financial regime changes and some non-recurrent income streams reduce, it remains imperative that the trust continues to seek ways to increase efficiency and provide value for money in its services. Significant productivity and efficiency gains are required both internally and across the wider system if the trust is to reach a position of underlying financial sustainability, whatever the financial regime. The trust is committed to delivering this, working with system partners in the years ahead and building on the strong foundations delivered during 2021-22. Should you require the end of your accounts in an accessible format, please contact the finance team on 0151 706 5497.